Hello. So um, I'm doing two videos. Um, I've already done one for um, people that use the system we use um, on basically how to get your 12 weeks of Christmas titles out that Gardeners very generously did as a promotion. Um, now there may be some in that 12 weeks promotion that you need to return. Um, and that's what I'm covering here. So this video is for the people not on the batch line system or the people that prefer to use um, a more graphical interface, um, i.e. Edelweiss. So um, what I did, if I share my screen, um is let's go into screen one share that um i used the isbn's that ruth very kindly gave us um uh ruth gardner that is uh, very kindly gave us um as the 12 weeks promotion i've loaded that into a collection in edelweiss collections are really useful for bookshops for uh, gardeners for publishers um, but a collection is essentially your own catalogue um, so not a publisher catalogue, but your own catalogue that you can use. Um, so I have used the ISBNs from that list to create um, this collection. Um, what I'm going to do is I'll post the link to this collection. Once you've viewed it, you'll always be able to view it. Um, it will be in your recently viewed things. Um, so all you need to do is click on the link, which is going to take you to the 12, Gardener's 12 Weeks 2021 uh, list of books. Now, the great thing about this, using it with Edelweiss, is you're gonna get the jackets, you're gonna be able to see how popular the book is globally, you know, or globally in the UK market, um, by, use, by the, using the green bar. You're also gonna be able to see whether you've got stock of it. Um, which is obviously quite key if you're trying to return something. Um, so first thing you do, once you clicked on the link, um, at the bottom you have this orange bar, create yourself an order. Now it's not an order, but I'm using this um, functionality in order to um, build myself a list of what I'm going to return. So create new order, I'm going to call this uh, gardeners 12 weeks and I'm not going to share it with anyone I don't need to share it with anyone um, so we're going to save that uh, oh I already did this as a test so I'm just going to put something on the end of that so save that it's going to warn me I'm not sharing it with my rep well I don't want to it's not really in order so that's fine I'm going to click OK there um, now um, what I can do is I've got this orange box ready to put numbers in to order. Um, again, it's not an order. But the useful thing about doing this in Edelweiss is if as long as you're contributing your data, so that's Gardlink, uh, Batchline, Merleo, um, and Booksolve people, although the Merleo and Booksolve aren't fully on yet, but they will be, um, it knows that you've got stock of this. So this little number above my yellow, my orange um, order box indicates that I've got two in the shop and I've actually got one on order as well. So I'm gonna to want to return these. Um, so I'm gonna put a two in there for the ones that I've got in stock. I might even go to my system and cancel the order that is outstanding, if it really is outstanding. Um, I can then press tab to the next book and the next book and the next book. OK, so I've got two of these. Now, this actually sold really well. In fact, I've got one on order, one in stock. Um, I might want to keep that one because it, it actually people just love that book uh, for some reason. Um, and I can also see, look, it sells well in other shops. Now, Christmas is over, but I'm sure, you know, if a little bit of snow comes, it's probably still going to sell. It's not really specifically Christmas. Uh, I do ramble on, don't I? Sorry. Um, anyway. I can tab through, tab, I don't have these, Bob Mortimer, I've only got one. We are a single copy shop, so uh, returns aren't um, a big problem for us, but um, there are going to be some titles in there that I am going to want to, to remove, to return. So yeah, I'm tabbing through, I haven't got any of these, I've only got one of these, but just for argument's sake, I'm going to return that one as well. Um, just so that I've got more in my return. There's Christmas Tales, so that one almost certainly I'm going to want to 
uh, return and so on and so on. Okay, once I've finished, obviously I haven't finished, but once I've finished, I can then go back up to my orders. Okay, there is my Gardener's 12 Weeks order that I've got three titles in. I can go into that order um, and then I can export it. Um, I can select my export format. I can just leave it as um, the batch line. That's my system that I use. Um, gardeners will have their own gardeners format. But basically you can download that file, um, open it up, import it into Gardlink, BookSolve, Merlio, Batchline, whichever one you use, um, and use that list as your returns list. Um, so yeah, that should be that should help you out. So basically, you're looking at a, the full list of everything that was in the promotion. Uh, you're building an order, um, either from the statistics that are coming from your system that tells you whether it's in stock or not, or if you're not feeding into the analytics system, um, you're just going to have to kind of know whether you've got it or not. Um, and uh, then exporting it, putting it back into your system as a return. And that is it, I think. Um, I'm keen to promote this way of doing it because actually once you're, you've got um, practice of doing an order as a return, you're then practiced in doing an actual order as well, uh, which we've got more and more publishers coming online with Adelweiss. So, um, uh, some really big hitters as well. So um, it's worth your while just spending a little bit of time um, learning how to do orders in a device. Good. Okay. Uh, yep. I hope you're all well and um, see you soon. Bye bye.